Uh, here we have some morning flurries out there once again, a little bit of light snow in parts of Washington and uh, Waukesha County, even into Ozaki as well. Not quite as widespread as yesterday, but yes, another morning of seeing some flurries and light snow across the area. More back off to the northwest as well, and just not quite as widespread as yesterday either, as the storm system is finally starting to leave. You can see the more action into lower Michigan. That's what we had yesterday. A uh, little mixture of sun and clouds. You can see, not sun, but clearing and clouds. You can see that brightening up of the sky, but also the cloud cover there. We will see uh, some light snow showers here in Milwaukee within the next hour. 34 degrees in Milwaukee. Northwest wind at 15, making it feel even worse. So we have these little batches of light snow this morning. Then we're going to get a little bit of a break, even some sunshine off and on throughout the day, but it's not a break from the wind. Still very gusty at 15 to 30 miles per hour. Then as we get toward the evening commute, some isolated showers popping up around the area, and it should be just rain as temperatures will be in the mid 40s. That's it. Highs in the mid 40s. Then things start to quiet down. The winds even start to die down for the first time in three days as well. You're waking up to 20s and 30s around the Badger State. Here in Milwaukee County, it is 31 in South Milwaukee and Oak Creek, 31 in West Dallas, a very common number around Milwaukee, and 32 in Shorewood. It is 30 in Watertown and Waukesha, so there are freezing temperatures all across the area, 32 in Sheboygan and Fond du Lac, and then you factor in that 15 to 30 mile per hour wind. Wind chills this morning are cold. Lower 20s across most of southeastern Wisconsin. Feels like 26 in Kenosha. 22 very common from Fond du Lac, West Bend, and over towards Port Washington. So we have this gusty northwest wind. Still the battleground between the high pressure will bring us nicer weather tomorrow and the low pressure to the north. Watch what happens later this afternoon. Another little round of some light rain developing before things start to clear out overnight. Plenty of sunshine for Thursday. Still breezy. Northwest winds at 10 to 15, but not quite as gusty. And then Friday, sunshine and light winds all day long. Highs today only in the mid 40s across the area and still very windy. Look what happens to the wind tonight. It starts to die down and the temperatures drop like a rock under a clearing sky. Could see a hard freeze in the inland areas, which worries me just a little bit as the trees are pretty vulnerable right now as those buds are just starting to pop out across the region. A seven day forecast 46 today, 31 tomorrow, 50. For Thursday in breezy conditions, lighter winds and sunshine for Friday could see some rain and snow mix late Friday night into early, early Saturday morning. A high of only 45 Saturday, 51 on Sunday, and it looks to be rainy on Tuesday. Tatiana? Taking a look at those.